morning guys uh, thanks for coming back to the channel wasn't going to do this video but the results were so amazing that I thought I had to show you um, there's a lot of stuff on the internet about how to clean your downheaders from your motorbike and um, I've been doing my research and reading it up and some of the items on there are absolutely uh, astounding in the amount of money that they're offering for it um, but a lot of people are coming back to the Harpic option which is something that I thought I would try um, for about pound sixty to a pound eighty for a bottle, it was a bargain. And uh, as you can see on the uh, the pictures, uh, either before or after this video, I've made my mind up yet. Um, the results were incredible. And um, this isn't something that I'd recommend for someone who's got um, very high chrome on their downpipes, um, because I know it can be quite corrosive. Um, but I think if you wash it off quickly afterwards, you don't leave it on for too long then you'll get the same kind of results that I've seen on this bike and it's something that um, I was astounded by I didn't think it had come up anywhere near as good as it did um, for me it worked uh, for you it could work um, be a little bit careful with it but um, definitely worth checking out if it's uh, your downpipes are as bad as what they were on this bike and um, you, you might get the same results anyway comment below if you, uh, you've had a similar experience or if your experience was bad it would be interesting to know what went wrong right so this is obviously after I've done a coat now the left hand header there was already um, pretty decent but the right one was the right state and it's come up really well so um, but I only left it on for a couple of minutes and it was a very very light application so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it a bit more I've got it onto an abrasive pad uh, I'm glad this doesn't come in um, a spray can because it's um, it can be quite corrosive to stuff around it so I'm not going to leave it on for 10 minutes as some people have stated but I did want to get to the parts that I couldn't get to before and that's largely because um, I had a bit of trim on that I've now removed just to make it a little bit easier This is highly corrosive stuff guys so I would recommend taking precautions when you're using it. That's all of the visible parts. I'm just going to do it when you get down here which you don't see because of the, um, the trim and it being quite low. This may give a good indication on how well this stuff actually did bring these pits of metal up <sighs> so that's it I'm going to give it a couple of minutes I'm going to get it going over with the abrasive side of this scour and then we'll wash it off thoroughly uh, to make sure there's no excess products left on the bike so hopefully that's come out okay right so it's been on I'd say less than five minutes um, some of the YouTube guides as I mentioned do say up to ten minutes but I don't think I'm gonna get any better than what I've got now so just to make sure that I wash all of it off I am actually going to use my hose and then I'll uh, go over it afterwards but already just down there on the bits that I did that were out of sight actually come up really well so I'll finish getting this off and then I'll give you a final look well that's it um, not a huge difference from when I first done it but they have come up even better like I do not use this if you've got a high chrome finish I think it's going to strip it even though I can see the parts of the uh, the pipes that had chrome on it have still got chrome on it but um, these pipes were uh, probably uncleaned for several years so to get this result which is nowhere near perfect but it's so much better than it was before and um, I'm yeah well happy with this so 
um, up to you if you use it but for me it worked I hope it does for you and I hope this has been informative um, some of the products as I mentioned before were going up to like 60 70 pounds for a tin and it seems ridiculous when as long as it's uh, not show quality you want you can get this for about pound sixty so I hope that helped uh, well that's it done again on this bike and it, as you can see it come out really really well so um, hopefully it'll do the same for you if you like what you see please like share subscribe and uh, I'll see you soon